Hey everyone, it's Barkat here. In today's video, I am going to show you how to create the perfect Google Ads call only campaign. And if you are looking to drive more direct calls to your business and maximize your ad spend, this step by step guide is exactly what you need. I will cover everything from setting up the campaign to optimizing it for the best results. So let's dive in and get those phones ringing. So before set up a call only campaign, you need a couple of things. So first thing you just need to make sure that you have the call conversion tracking set up properly and you will have, you know, proper understanding, proper ad groups and ad group structures. And you will have to have your keyword in your hand, like what types of keyword you are going to target and what are the keywords you are going to use under each specific ad group. Also, you need to make sure that you have a landing page here. The landing page is not mandatory, but it's needed to, you know, you need to replace a landing page or maybe website. You can also put the website URL on the final destination URL. So to create a call only campaign, you just need to click on the new campaign and hit on the new campaign. I'm going to set up the call only campaign for a plumber. So that's why I'm just, you know, clicking these leads and once i select this list see here i have not set up any conversion actions under this account so that's why it's showing that nothing found here so to as i mentioned that before if you want to set up a call only campaign you will have to set up the call conversions first and if you don't know how to set up a call conversions i have a you know dedicated video how to set up the google ad call only conversions so here you can see this is my video google ads call conversion tracking so this is my video and i will link this video on my description so that you can check this video from my descriptions as well and i believe if you watch this 14 minute video and you will not have a single question regarding the google call only conversions or maybe google call conversion tracking or something so i highly recommend to watch this video before you set up a call only campaign so for now i will just skip this one and just hit continue and here you can see which campaign the campaign type should be searched and now i will just hit continue so after selecting this so see here so here is the main difference actually so you know if you if i click the website widget it should be the search campaign like it should be typically search campaign i mean you can create responsive searcher and if i click on the phone calls this button so it will be a call campaign so i need to put my client's phone number or maybe you know the phone number where you want to receive phone calls so i just need to put this kind that kind of phone number here so here i have a dummy landing page and this landing page is built on chl i just you know build this for just recording purpose i mean so that i can record this video so I have a dummy number actually so let me copy this number for now and just paste it here so I need to remove this you know and I need to make sure the format is good enough so this is the number format I Google is suggesting us so I just you know put this dummy number here and just hit continue and I need to put a campaign name let's say call campaign for video or something and it continue and here's the most important thing so when i start a campaign whether it's a call campaign whether it's a search campaign whatever the campaign type is i always use manual cpc you know from scratch when i set up a campaign and once i have proper data in my campaign then i just switch to the maximize conversions or you can use the maximize clicks as well but i highly recommend to use manual cpc because when you use the manual cpc you will have the access you know to increase the keyword width limit for a specific keyword so for now you know you can see here you can't use the manual cpc here but after set up the campaign i will choose the manual cpc for now just click on the clicks i mean maximize clicks and i will just set up a let's say bit limit let's say you know 10 or something and just you know hit continue and i will uncheck this for sure no doubt about it and enter location so i will just click the so though i am from liverpool uk so i just put the liverpool uk for this video purpose so include and this one city only just and always make sure that you target this one not presence or interest always make sure that you target only the presence so i'll you know click the presence one and it should be turn off hit next and i will skip this one as well so when it comes to the ad group you as i mentioned that before you need to have all of these on your hand how many ad groups you are going to create so for this video i will just you know create one ad group let's say emergency uh, number 
or emergency plumber or something emergency plumber and i have couple of keywords so i will use this all of the keywords like plumbing emergencies emergency plumbing services plumbing repair local emergency services kind of things all of the keywords i am using phrase match but i will use both phrase and exit so i use a tool called adword wrapper so if i just put all of these keywords under adword wrapper and just hit wrap keyword so this tool will give me all of the phrase and exit match versions and i will copy and paste and just you know i just paste it here so right now we are using all of the keywords is phrase and exit match so we are done with our first ad group i mean the keywords and ad group name emergency plumber and now it's done to the right the ad copy so as for final url i will just copy and paste my dummy landing page url and just hit paste and also uh hit paste and display path i will use emergency plumber emergency plumber nearby since there are just two headline options so what i will do actually i will just use one keyword focused and second should be call to action so let's say this is the emergency plumbing ad group so in headline one what i will do actually like same day plumbing services plumbing services this is headline one and on the two i mean on headline two i mean position two i will use offering 100 percent free estimates so for business name i will use just a random business name liverpool plumbing pros so this is a random you know business name i don't know this business exists or not so for now uh description line one i will just use this one so it's a kind of you know trusted plumbing expert for 25 years you know call now uh first response and 100 percent guaranteed services kind of thing so it looks nice i i would probably say so for description line two i will use this one we are committed to first and friendly services with no hidden fees call us today so i think we are all done and in terms of call reporting it should be turned on which we we have you know like you know we turned on the call reporting on this account i mean you can find these on the account level make sure that you turn on the call reporting so that google can track all of these calls you know insert these here i will show you how you can find all of the calls you know inside this google ad or dashboard under the report sections and also under the conversions actions you can see you know calls from air and this is the default one so if you have any specific conversion actions for you know tracking calls from the ad so you can you know use this one you will find here once you have any conversion actions under the conversion tracking stuff so this is the default one you know i am just using calls from ad i think it's done and i will hit next so for the budget it depends on the clients you know how much clients want to spend you know on monthly basis or on weekly basis though this is a call only ad we are not going to run call only campaign seven days per week because you know client will not you know have available options to receive the phone calls or something that's why i highly recommend you just talk with your client and how much budget you want to spend on google per month whether you can spend x amount of money on you know weekly basis or something it, it depends on you and, and on your clients for now i will just you know use this 50 pound a day you know and hit next so my campaign is ready to publish and i will just you know click on the publish button and my campaign will be published in few seconds i believe yeah so my just campaign is just published and so this is the call only campaign so i need to go through the bidding for a second so let me check the bidding first so hit on the campaigns and just click on the setting and i need to change the bidding so as i mentioned that i need to you know use the manual cpc just hit on the manual cpc and i don't use this you know enhanced cpc versions because if you just click on this you know enhanced cpc so google can charge you a lot you know like if you set up a bid let's say you know 30 dollar or you know 30 pound per keyword click so google will charge you more than 30 or more than you know like 35 or something so that's why i don't recommend to use this one so unless you have huge budget then you can use this one but unless you don't have much budget i don't recommend you to use this one and just hit save so all done i need to put a you know like default max cpc bid limit on the ad group level so let's say for the ad group one i will just you know like put seven or something so it depends on you actually like when the keyword research phase you will have a proper idea how much you want to bid for this kind of you know ad group or this kind of keywords and once i added this max 
the default NL CPC under the ad group level it applied on all keywords so after running this campaign of couple of days or maybe week then Google will suggest you how much you want to bid on a specific level you know keyword level let's say you know emergency plumber near me this exact match variant Google is suggesting as let's say you know like uh, 14 pound or something then you need to increase this if it makes sense then you need to increase this to the 14 pound or something you know and same same thing happened like let's say you know emergency plumbing services near me for phrase match one google is suggesting as just three bucks or something like this then you can decrease the you know weed so if it doesn't make sense to your business so yeah you can of course you can you know decrease the bit so this is the beauty of manual cpc that's why i highly recommend you to use the manual cpc unless you have you know lots of data in this account or something then you can switch to the maximus conversions but rather than you know like choosing the ma maximus clicks you can use the manual cpc there is like no doubt about it so our call campaign i mean call only campaign is done and i just created only one ad group so i believe you have the idea how to create the ad group so for this video i am not making too many ad groups so i think you have the idea how to create the ad groups properly so right now i will just talk about the asset real quick so under asset we don't have anything here so we need to add a couple of things site links you can use but you know it seems it's a call only campaign i don't think so site links is mandatory to use i personally i don't because it's a call only campaign but if you have any search campaign on this account you should have you know site link extensions but for the call only campaign the most two important thing is call extensions i mean call extension and another is call out extensions and the location extension these three so i will just you know like go through step by step let's say call out extensions so i will use couple of call out extensions on the campaign level so let me create some so i'm just creating on the campaign level so i will just select the campaign so let's say you if you have any type of discount let's say senior discounts or maybe you know better in discounts or something like this so, so i will use this one as well like better in discount and i will use let's say if you have any types of reviews like how many reviews you have so i will use like 45 plus uh, 5 is star, five is star reviews then i will use one more like if we have any types of offer for the drain cleaning stuff let's let's say uh 49 dollar uh drain cleaning drain cleaning every level something like for the drain cleaning drain cleaning every level oh, i think for the drain cleaning, drain cleaning is fine so i highly recommend you at least at 10 you know not more than 10 or more, not less than 10 and for now i will just hit save and also i will just add some structure snippet on the campaign level so i will use uh, the service catalog and this is the plumbing company right we are just creating the call only ad for the plumbing company so service catalog means what type of services they provide so let's say you know drain install and replacement or maybe i will just use drain install and cleaning something like this and also if the service has a soil repair you can use the soil repair as well if they have any types of like hydro jetting services you can use hydro jetting sorry hydro jetting oh there should be space i believe yeah, hydro jetting or if they have any types of like you know trenchless or maybe you know tankless water heater repair or maybe i can use the water heater uh water heater repair or maybe water heater you know like service or something like this maybe water to service so i think you know you got my point right like what types of services your client provides so that's all you can add under the you know structure snippet under the service catalog so yeah for now i'll just you know hit save and our instruction snippet is created so then we just need to add the call extensions so i just need to you know create call extensions i will add this on the campaign level and for number i will use my dummy landing page number so just copy and paste the number from here copy and paste it here and i need to you know remove the dot instead of dot i need to do i just hit save so that's it we have all done i believe yeah and last thing you need to add the location extension so it's pretty easy just click on the you know plus button and 
I already have, I believe, one location. I mean, business profile setup, but I don't have any locations under this one. So it's pretty easy. So just click on the new new location group and just you know find out the locations. If you have any location group under your Google My Business profile, if you don't know how you can add you know location extension with your Google Ad account, I do have any another dedicated video as well. You can check this out. I will try my best to link this video below as well so that you can check. You know, it's pretty easy and straightforward process. Nothing complicated. I have already my you know Google My Business profile set up under this account. I mean, it is interlinked, so yeah, it will show. So I believe we all done you know with our campaign, but one thing left actually. So I need to select this one and under the ad schedule you need to add ad schedules so for now i will just use the monday to friday and it should be nine or probably ten i will use nine for now or maybe eight and it depends on the businesses like you need to you know when you onboard a client you will have all of the data on the onboarding sheet i believe so yeah you can you know decide based on the onboarding sheet or you know you can talk with the clients so, and for now eight to five i believe let's say eight to six and hit save and yeah it's done like eight to six because this is a colonial campaign and we will not receive any phone calls over the weekend so that's why we are not running ad on the weekend so yeah just monday to friday and i believe we all set and uh, you just need to you know create more ad groups to show your ad so this is the simple and straightforward process to create a call only campaign so as i mentioned that there is just one disadvantage in terms of you know like uh, cpc you know cost per click is a little bit expensive rather than you know if you run a search campaign like typically search campaign otherwise i think it makes sense it's pretty straightforward and people can directly you know receive the phone calls from their google ad you don't need to you know like spend lots of time creating the landing page and anything because if you have the website url or if you have the menu website you can use these as a landing page on the google ad you know like call only campaign on final url part so it's pretty and straightforward so i think you all said you just need to make sure that you have the proper breakdown on the keyword and ad group so if you don't know how to break down this one as well so i do have another video on my channel so i will try my best to link that video as well in my descriptions and you can watch this all of this video from my descriptions and i believe if you follow my you know step by step process you can create a google call only campaign successfully and trust me accept this i don't do anything if you like this video please press the like button and subscribe this channel to get this kind of you know content in near future and for now that's all from my end and i will see you on the next one thank you have a great day bye bye